piano in my drawing room in uh, Kenya and Na Nairobi when I was four or five, you know, trying stuff out, dis making discoveries, developing my musical ear from a young age, and it's always been there. Yeah, it's always come easily, um, and it's it's kind of been my challenge as well because the thing which you most identify as being what you're closest to, what, what you're most about, is also your greatest fear. That if I, if I fail, if I don't fulfill my potential here, who am I? I could be, I could be a waste of space. I can't sit down and decide to be creative. I can't say, right, now I'm going to be creative. That just doesn't lead to anything. Um, it's a, a gradual process of letting go of the conscious awareness, allowing the conscious awareness to let go and a different type of consciousness to come in, which is playful or um, non-judgmental. Um, exploratory, really quite childlike, and they come into my conscious awareness and I will say, that's, that's good, I'm going to work with that, and I will, as it were, take that, I will place it centre stage, I will allow that to then develop in itself by, by means of the collaborative process between my creative mind, which is not conscious, and uh, the conscious mind. So it's the, that's playing Iranian style. I could play it like the picture of the ancient Egyptian, like this. That's a bit of a stretch. <laughs> the opportunities that I was given by David Anderson to write the music for his films combined opportunity and um, trust that I was allowed to trust myself <clears throat> and um, where I got the feeling that I wasn't being trusted that tended to cut down that tended to shut down the creative process because it is about self-trust and feeling that other people trust you to be able to use one's gift <laughs> I look forward to being an elder because I think the elders have an essential role to play in our, in, our, in life in, in human society. You know, in the old days there always used to be a granny or a granddad sitting in the corner, and uh, without that, we're a little bit rootless because our ancestors are our roots and our elders are the living representatives of our ancestors. Mm -hmm.